I will be performing the hip quadrant test, which can also be called the scour test. The purpose of this test is to determine nonspecific hip pathologies. It also checks the tightness of the joint capsule and can determine early hip degeneration. So my patient is lying supine on the table and this test is done passively so the examiner flexes the hip and also brings it into adduction all the way to the point where the hip almost starts to come off the table. The examiner then applies a compressive force down on the knee through the femur while passively moving the hip in an arc fashion into abduction. Okay. Uh, the examiner should be looking for catching, grinding, clicking sounds while performing the test. A positive sign would be if the patient's pain is reproduced. Also, that catching and grinding of the femur in the joint and a limited range of motion. So this test should be performed bilaterally, starting with the unaffected leg first. And a place where student massage therapists can reference this test is online, and I'll provide a link below. Thank you.